mistake. I'm really worried. Uh, Ricky, what's up? The Butler twins, Abigail and Gabby. You know them? No, but uh, I've seen them around. What's 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 going on? What's wrong? They went out fishing yesterday, and they didn't come back. Well, the lake sure is pretty safe so long as they stay out of the marsh. That's just it. They weren't at Lost Lake. They went east, over to the Metolius River. The hell were they thinking? Okay, all right, yeah. I'll uh, I'll see if I can find them. Deacon, thank you so much. How's it going? start there. Digging up. Okay, the girls were fishing. Oh, shit. Marauders, Jesus. Up this way. Oh, Jesus. Don't let him go. No, let's do this. Broke it over his head. Okay, way to go, Abigail. Don't go with the fight. We just have to get you back to camp. Come on, come on, with me. No, no, no. I can make it myself. I can. Okay, go, go.
job came up. That old tube. Where are you? Guess I'll come back late. Here we go. Oh, that'll do it. Okay. Blade. Where am I gonna find a blade? Wait, wait, wait. Where, where was that sporting goods store? Take a look around. What do we got? Gotcha. Nope. Wrong direction. Okay, let's see. What's going on here? Back on track. Open the gate. Hey. Hey. I got those parts that you asked for. Oh, great. Well, uh, check back in a few. I'll see what I can do, yeah? Uh, Ricky. Thanks. Yeah. Boozer's one of us now. I'm here if you need me, man. Deke, thank God. Ricky, what's wrong? Do you know a man named Joshua Harper? Harp? Uh, yeah, yeah, I know him. I never trusted this son of a bitch. He, uh, wrapped the black bandana around his head like he was <laughs> some goddamn hipster or something. Yeah, well, your instincts are pretty spot on. He shot Dan Lane in the back over a card game and took off. Oh, Jesus, where is he now? A patrol spotted him heading south. They were too scared to even approach him. I guess he'd met up with a group of drifters. I really need your help on this one. Okay, uh, I'll handle it. I marked where they spotted him on your map. Thanks, Deke. Try to make forever a day or two, will ya? You here to buy something? Where the hell's my ratchet wrench? Looks like Harp and his men are heading to Camp Creek. You sure you can handle this? What do you think? Just asking. Lost Lake out. Do this the easy way, huh? Lost one! Put up a shell! Men coming! Crap! Dick, did you find him? Uh, yeah. I hear gunshots. No, oh, well, yeah, there's a spoon. No, oh. oh, well, yeah, there's a uh, swarm. I, I kind of got to him before I did. Jesus. Bring back his headscarf. Dan's people want proof that Harper is dead. Yeah, 
Okay, well, it might be a little bit messy. Fine. All right, sure, yes. Okay, got it. Oh, Jesus, what a mess. Okay, head back and talk to Ricky. Get my credits updated. Okay. There. Okay. Got it. Let me secure it in, okay? There you go. That's better. Okay. Hey, brother. Look what oh. Ricky did. What? Made me a new toy. Oh, it's all Deacon. <laughs> oh, that's he really, really cool, Boozer. Hey, uh, it could have been one of those, yeah. those three goddamn musketeers. Oh, Hung guard, you fucking okay. ripper. <laughs> Pretty cool. Oh, hey. Jesus. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, uh, maybe this hey. wasn't that good of an idea? God damn it. Okay. Hey, Ricky, uh, here's Tarp's bandana. <sighs> what a Good mess. Yep, that's what I said. Thanks, Deke. I'll let dance people late. know. Try to make Trevor a day or two, will ya? This thing is completely broken. I wonder about the freakers sometimes, you know? Like, do they feel pain? Anything? Hell, I don't know. Say, John, you there? It's O'Brien. Hold on. O'Brien, I'm sick of doing your dirty work. You got news for me or not? Yeah, I, I mean, yes, I have news. Well, then what is it? I, one last job. Were you listening to what I was just saying? I'm done with One this. One more job, then I'll meet you in person, show you what I got. Forget it. Her middle name. It was Irene, right? Sarah, Irene, Whitaker. It's on her admission form. One last job. And one Last job. I sent you the coordinates. O'Brien out. Hey. Hey. You're headed somewhere in a hurry? Yeah. You remember that Nero bastard I told you about, mm -hmm. O'Brien? Well, it looks like he's got some news for me, but I gotta do one last job for him first. Yeah. Okay. You should come with me. Yeah? Nah, I... Skizzle's got me on farm duty. Feeding the world one shitty weed at a time. Fuck Skizzle, I'll drop you off right afterward. When's the last time you saw a helicopter? I'll tell him he twisted my arm. Never gets old, does it? <clears throat> where are we headed? Over toward Malakwa Lake. You know where that is? Yeah, it's just north of the Rogue Tunnel off uh, Waldo Road. So what are we doing there? A Nero Chopper's gonna be on the ground doing... Whatever the hell it is that they do. O'Brien wants me to see what they're up to. So, O'Brien, he's, uh, he's what? Your, your shot caller? Handler? No! Jesus, Boozer, you know why the hell we're out here. Just asking. Seems like he tells you to jump. You ask how high. It's not how it is. So how you holding up? Not bad. Uh, it's been worse, you know. I actually don't mind working the farm, pulling weeds and shit. Reminds me of when I was a kid. I used to go out to my uncle's farm out at uh, by Adrian on the Idaho border. Spend summers working the beet fields. 
Yeah, a little dirt bike I tooled around on. That's where I learned to ride. If you're not careful, I'm gonna start calling you Farmer Bill. When we get to that site, stay close. Whatever happens, don't let them see you. They can get a little trigger happy. Okay, okay, got it. Stay down, keep my mouth shut, don't get us killed. Hey, thanks for bringing me along, Deke. It's good to get out again. Even riding fish, you know? <laughs> yeah. Okay, stay close. Right behind you. Hey, let me know when the LZ is locked down. Yeah, there Set it is. Set up a perimeter. I want it tight. Jesus. Okay, I thought I'd see get one this of those done. Again. In the air, I mean. All right, now watch. Soldiers come out first, they secure the LZ. Then their boy genius, researcher, scientist, whatever the hell, he comes out, he looks around. To do what? Whatever science shit they're doing out here, how the hell would I know? You're the one who's been spying on them. Catch any of that over my radio? That's pretty fucked up. Good taxpayer money and they're out here collecting freaker shit. Yeah, I told you. Who knows what they're doing or why? Oh, they gotta have a base around here somewhere, right? You try following them? Yeah, but they always disappear over the mountains heading south. And with the highway choked off, I can never get close. Sons of bitches. Seems like they got a lot to answer for. Yeah. Where are we headed now? It's a good question. O'Brien, are you there? Come in, O'Brien. You wait here. I don't want him getting skittish because I brought someone along. Yeah, I'll keep an eye on the bike. I've seen enough Nero assholes for one day. Okay, I'll be back. O'Brien said he had news. He knew her middle name, Irene. 
She can't be alive. But he's alive. Why not her, huh? There he is. Yo. Shit. Gotta stop doing that. What you got? All right, look. We'll lay it out for you, but it's not good news. I finally found a guy who was willing to do some digging through some files that we, they, they used to keep while they still kept records. Okay, no problem. Anyway, uh, Sarah Whitaker, your wife, was in, admitted to the Camp Mash unit on the South Flats outside of Silver Lake. According to the records, she was in surgery for six hours and then was moved okay, to... So she survived. The stab wound, she survived. Yeah, yeah. According to the records, she made a full recovery. And then she was moved to another camp on the outskirts okay, of Okay, So, so she could still be alive, even after all this time. She could still be alive. You're saying no. What do you mean, no? It was overrun. Everything was overrun. There were no survivors. You survived. They survived. Look, 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 there was nothing that would have protected that camp, okay? Highway 97 w w w is an artery. Infected freaks poured up from L.A., from the Bay Area, from Sacramento. There were thousands and thousands and thousands of them. There was, there was nothing we could do. I get it. So you bugged out. Who did you bring with you? Uh, Nero personnel. Some feds. People with clearance. Nero personnel. The soldiers. The guys with the guns. The guys that should have been protecting no, no, the there's civilians. There's nothing that you can do against a horde. Oh, no, too strong. I know all about fast. hordes. Well, they right. know that there was nothing that we could do. Oh, you know what you could have done? You could have brought a few of them with you. You could have saved a few lives. There was no hope. There was no time. There was no room, okay? We had already turned on each other by the time the hordes arrived. No, I get it. I'm sorry about your wife. I'm sorry about all of this. But you gotta understand, if you hadn't sent her with me that night, she would've been dead the next morning. You did the right thing. You know, if you had decided to stay, the only thing that would have happened is you'd be dead right alongside her. Don't you think I know that? <laughs> O'Brien. Thank you for saving her life that night. So you're sorry. Is that it, O'Brien? You're sorry? Oh, damn it. All things a waste of my goddamn time. Oh, what the hell? Boozer? Boozer? Oh, goddamn it, Booze, man. Where the hell did you go? Yeah, Ricky, I'm here. What's up? Schizo's been asking for you. Said Boozer never showed up for his work duty. I, I was worried. No, look, we're fine. We just had some stuff that we needed to get done. Tell Schizo we'll be back in an hour. Okay. Hey, I 
I'm almost ready to head back out there and fix that transformer. You still in? Uh, yeah. Yeah, just the... Great, let me know when. I can feel that hot water now. I'm gonna let that shower run forever. Yeah, okay. Uh, that's... that sounds great. Listen, uh, Ricky, I, I gotta go. All right, Deacon out. Over here! Oh, Jesus, Boozer, what the hell? I figured I'd do a little shopping while we were out, and I ran into a pack of rippers hunting dogs. Oh, easy, fella. See, he's not infected. You are he's, shit. he's just a dog. They're hunting down and killing healthy dogs. No, just, no, we can't, we can't leave him here, Deke. Uh, we just, we can't, we can't do it. Here, here, let me, uh, let me do it. Really? You, you can, okay, boy. Okay, you see, it's okay. All right, just hold oh, it. Jesus, D. It's okay, just, that's it. All right, it's okay, big guy. Rest. I'm ready. I see the Show him the way. had made this shit for me, you know, my arm, I mean, I don't know where I'd be. I mean, I guess I'd... Well, you know. Are you gonna be okay? Yeah, not like I got a choice. Not like any of us do, right? Yeah, okay, come on. Hey, there's your bike. Hey, how'd it go? How'd oh, what go? You know, goddamn wall. Your guy in the space suit, what'd he say? Ah, oh, it doesn't matter. Hey, come on, goddammit. <sighs> Boozer, you really don't want to be doing that right now. Oh, yeah? You think I need more than this to take down your scrawny little ass? Come on, what'd he say? Drop it. Seriously, what happened to Sarah? Huh? Where's your old lady? Where's your old lady? Huh? <laughs> 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 Stay down, brother! Had enough? Where's your old lady, Deke? She's dead, Boozer. Sarah's dead. Yeah, and she's been dead a long time, so don't you think that you mourned her long enough? Oh, God. I think... I think that you have a hell of a left hook, asshole. Oh. Yeah, it's the only move I got. <laughs> Come on, man. I gotta get my sorry ass back to work. Camp ain't gonna feed itself. It's the only move I got. Still, I tagged your ass with it three times in a row. Oh, fucking shit, <laughs> Where are we headed? Back to camp. No, no. I still gotta work a shift. Give me a ride up there. It's it's just north of Sherman's camp. Okay.
So she died that night. And there was nothing you or anyone could have done about it. I should have been there. Well, what good would that have done? Just drop it, it's done. Come on, you guys. Come on, keep working. Keep at it. We don't work, we don't eat. Right already. That's it. Hey. Thanks for the ride. We all start. There you go. What? The gathering info. See how long it takes these sons of bitches to die or starve off. Hang on, I'm trying to get a read on when the feds can reemerge from their hiding holes and crawl back into their unjust positions of power. The freaks are on our side. All the feds can rot down there in their stony prison. The world may not be ours anymore, but thanks to the freaks, it doesn't belong to the feds either. This is Mark Copeland. Hold on, hold on, I'm coming. You wanna die out here? Look, there's a camp that... Camp? I'll go, I'll go. Where? Show me, show me! Head to Lost Lake. Ask for Ricky Patel. She'll take you in. Thank you so much for stopping. I was so dead. I was never getting out of there. Thank you. Tell them it was Deacon. They'll know. Stay off the main roads. Don't stop. We really pissed off everyone on both sides. Well, I mean, not everyone. But I want you to know that that's how much you mean to me. That I would give up anything for you. Anything. <sighs> this ring is a symbol of my love. And it is precious. It has no beginning and no end. I love you. Shit, more of them.
This ring is my promise that I'm always going to love you. And I ain't ever going to leave you. Uh, you, you may kiss the bride. Oh, wait, wait a second. Here, you can have this one back. But only if you promise to ride me as much as you ride your bike. <laughs> well, I now pronounce you man and, well, wife. Okay, let me, let me just go. Man, you there? Yeah, Deke, what's up? You remember that little church? The one Sarah and I got married in? Well, I found a couple of assholes trashed in the place. Wish I'd been there. I'd have helped you kill them all. Mess with Sarah's church. Shit. Yeah, anyway. Just checking in. Deacon out. Got someone at the gate. Open the gate. I wonder about the freakers sometimes, you know? Like, do they feel pain? Anything? Hell, I don't know. You got what you need? Yep, everything I could think of. Let's go. Well, you sound pretty excited. It's the candle, Deke. What? The old saying, it's better to light one candle than curse the darkness. We've spent the last two years doing a whole lot of cursing. We get the lights on at Lost Lake, and that's lighting our first candle. Yeah, only one problem with that. And what's that, Deke? Lights attract all kinds of nasty bugs, and they make it way easier for him to find you. Hey, we're here! Shit! Warmers. I was hoping it was gonna be clear. Nah, why would we have that kind of luck? Yeah. Damn freakers, burn! Okay, I think that's all of them. Crap. Okay, to fix this thing, I gotta climb up there. <laughs> Have you done this before? Nope, but there's a first time for everything, right? Right. Okay, come on, boost me up. All right, ready? Uh-huh. One, two, three! <laughs> If you fall, it ain't like I can catch you. Gee, thanks. I'll try to keep that in mind. Notes. I got him. Deep. Time.
God damn it! Oh, well, that was fun. Yeah, we're gonna have to come out and do this again sometime. Yeah, I'll talk to Schizo about getting some barbed wire around this. It'll keep the newts off. Yeah, sounds like the kind of shit job he likes to give me. <laughs> You'll live. Come on, I gotta check something else out. Something like that. But she's not. No. I'm sorry. Look, it's not a big deal, so let's just drop it. Okay. Wow. Word gets around. I'm almost ready. Power to the whole resort is routed through here. I pulled the breaker a week ago, so it wouldn't short out. Okay. Ready when you are. All right. Let's listen up. Okay. Now, the past few months have been tough. Not going to deny that. We're low on food, medicine, hell. Pretty much everything. But we got one thing in spades. And without that, everything else is meaningless. That one thing is trust. Yeah. 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 Now, a while ago, we had some more drifters right in the camp. Some of you said kick them out. We ain't got enough for ourselves. Some of you said we can't trust them. Tonight is proof of what I've been saying all along. We need everyone. I mean everyone who is willing to be here, who is willing to work, who is willing to help us rebuild. Now for the past couple of months, Ricky has been doing just that. She can't do it alone. She needs help. Tonight is going to happen because we welcomed a drifter into our camp. We allowed him to earn our trust. Tonight, we take one more step out of the darkness. Nothing. Mm -hmm. Come on, let's go see Addy. Is that the woman in the photo? That was her? That was my wife, yeah. Dumb question. I'm I'm sorry, Dick. No, don't be. She's uh she's been dead a long time. Still, it can't be easy to get your hopes up like that, only to I, I don't know. I wish there was something I could do. Well, there is. What? Stop talking about it. Okay. Addie? Addie! Oh, the lights are up. I don't think she's here. Addie, you here? Okay, well, strip. Strip, strip what? Take your shirt off, sit on the table. Hey, look, it's nothing. Deacon, do you want an infection? Mm-hmm. I may be an engineer, Deke, but that does not mean... Aha, 
that I don't know how to treat a cut. Yeah, I never would have guessed the way that you were caressing those switches and circuits or whatever the hell you were doing. <laughs> All right, this <clears throat> might hurt just a little bit. Ready? Oh, Jesus. Okay. Really? Come on, why do just wait for Addie to come back, just, huh? Shh. Hang on. There. It's done. Big baby. So I told you it was nothing. <laughs> yeah, you did. <clears throat> oh, wow. You really have been at war. Yeah, more than one. Shit, that's right. Where was this one? Afghanistan or the MC or after? I, uh, I don't remember. What about this one? Ricky, uh, I'm not sure that, um, uh, why are that Addie doesn't really like, um, people messing around in her. Yeah, I, I heard that too. What about this one? <sighs> Dick, I'm not married. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Why don't you come back tomorrow and see Addie and she's going to tell you how great of a job I did. Ricky, um... Deke, it's, it's, it's fine. You're welcome. Hey, Deacon? <clears throat> Maybe one day, stop and light a candle. It can get pretty dark and cold out there. <laughs>